guys welcome back to my channel it's me again you guys it's such a busy period for me at the moment and I'm filming vlogmas video so I have to film a lot of my videos in advance I hope that's okay with you uh, please don't be annoyed to be like oh I can tell she's filming her videos in advance because she is wearing the same outfit I'm busy honey okay and I'm trying to keep up with this channel so please make sure that you support me um, in vlogmas um, the more you watch my videos the more I know that my videos are resonating um, so before we talk about Chanel honey and her wig please 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 I beg of you to uh, support this channel um, and um, yeah please support my channel basically and fully subscribe okay we're gonna go through everything by the time you watch this video you should have already seen my Chanel Dakar 23a preview video which I would love to know what you think about that one as well um, but today we're going to talk about Chanel 23p and Chanel 23s if you're new to Big C and her wig um, the Chanel spring summer show um, tends to or collection tends to be split into two different collections you have the pre collection which is 23p p means print on print on print on but beg your pardon is spring in French and then you have 23s which is of course s for summer um, so there's some new pictures that I wanted to show you, um, really beautiful pictures um, of some new items that are coming for 23P um, and 23S. I think most of these are 23P, uh, are 23P, I can't speak today, um, items, but some might be 23S. But basically everything is from the print on portion, so the pre-collection. Let's start off with this one here. This is a beautiful, fun... Um, this is just fun I love this I love the pink and green this kind of reminds me of that collection they did a few years ago um, remember, does anyone remember the Coco splash bags those like transparent bags I know that this isn't transparent but they were very vibrant with colors the vibrancy of these colors kind of reminds me of that and then the next one we have this this super cute bag this looks like tweed or flannel I love the double C's like on the chain um, and the accents on the chain look so darling so adorable love these um, there is a troll piece this is a troll this is a green troll honey um, but it is a troll this is tiny um, I was watching Maria, Maria Dragonova's cruise 2023 a video she did a shopping vlog and um, in one of the scenes like she puts uh, like she was looking at the display and there, there is that like 23c cruise casino chip bag on the website I think there was like a hope and a prayer that maybe it might fit a card holder it looked so small on the mannequin i was like oh my god on the mannequin it looks tiny this is tiny <laughs> this is a chanel troll honey and it's very very small um okay the next one here is this denim um, chanel 22 interesting i think this is going to be huge i think clients are going to love this and be all over i think it's going to be absolutely massive and then there's a super cute um green troll piece it reminds me of one of the trolls from the 22c cruise collection so not this cruise collection the year before there was a there was a bag that looked similar to this and it was um yeah kind of similar to this basically but again very small this is going to be very small um when you look at these pictures you're like oh my god it's going to be so big it's so big it's huge no it's not let me stop you right there there's nothing huge about this it is not going to be huge um, at all there are also some shoes so I just want to quickly put those up on the screen um, so that you can see them there are a lot of interesting things that are coming for this 20 23p and 23s um, collection there are a lot of beautiful um, yeah items so I just wanted to quickly um, show you I'd love to know what you guys um, think about everything and I would love to know um, basically like when it pertains to Chanel like what are your favorite um, like collections of the year I believe in an interview an, an executive from Chanel said that the cruise uh, not the cruise collection the Metier d'Art collection is their most profitable collection is their most financially successful one which is so interesting you'd think it would be spring summer um, but allegedly they sell through like Metier d'Art very well um, but I love their spring summer collections and their cruise collections I think their cruise and spring summer collections are the most fun I wanted to quickly show you a bunch of other bags um, from 23p so the pre-collection here they are absolutely gorgeous um, 
Um, there are a few really beautiful pieces here. I think I may have shown some of these before, but let me just show them again. I'll just put them up on the screen. I love, love, love um, so many of the bags here. I love the colors. I love the way they're adding like pink and green. Those are beautiful summery um, colors um, for spring, summer. They're so perfect. I mean, when you see pink and green, that really does make you think of spring, summer, particularly green because you think of nature, plants, trees. It just feels so verdant and refreshing and nourishing. Um, there's some tote bags here as well, which I think will be quite um, interesting. They might do quite well. There's a Chanel 19 shopper bag. Um, this is interesting. I would need to see how this looks like in person. It kind of reminds me of those like Louis Vuitton on the go pillow bags, which are very controversial. Some people love them and think they look really cool and casual. Other people think they look deflated, weird and creepy. Um, I think again, it just depends how it looks like in person. It might actually look really good. Um, and there are a few other um, items here as well from Cruise. There's some very interesting looking classics um, in this collection. I don't know if you can see that one on the top left. Um, there's this reissue. It looks like in a neutral kind of color, like in a camel color. It's a bit, bit neutral. There's also like this papillon um, shaped bag um, as well. There's this gorgeous pink and um, green one which looks very similar to the one that I've just shown you um, as well so yeah like I said this is the pre-collection 23p um, yeah this is incredibly exciting so this collection is going to be coming out um, in January probably like mid towards the end of January that's when we're going to see this collection um, in boutiques there are a bunch of mini with top handles as well in like a kind of pink lilac um, a neutral kind of white and also very beautiful bright green as well there are a lot of great options out there if you're looking for something fun and vibrant you know when it pertains um to chanel um chanel i feel like chanel is going to do what chanel is going to do but i feel like they are so good at these like spring summer um bags because they, i don't know i just feel like chanel understands spring summer like better than other brands like they always make things that look fun and fresh and modern as well there's also this bag which is interesting i don't know what you guys think about this one but this is interesting and this caught my eye this this is going to be in 23p it's like denim denim bags at chanel are massive people love denim um, bags i think the price point helps but also the fact that it's like a fun casual bag that you can wear like on like on day to day as well so yeah just really really like this this one as well um there's another denim one there and then the mini with the top handles again there are a few others i just want to quickly show you there's some cocoa handles as well this really beautiful cocoa handle you guys should know how i feel honey about the cocoa handle it's, it wouldn't be my first choice <laughs> um but i do think that this is very fun and vibrant as well so i just wanted to quickly show you some of the things that will be coming for 23p um, please let me know what you guys think about um, everything that is coming from Chanel and yeah let me know if you are reserving anything or picking anything up so like I said towards the end of January February but it really should be like mid mid January going forwards is when we should start to hear the launch date um, so if you're interested but presumably you're going to start reserving items um, with your essay um, if you're interested um, yeah and also shout out to one of my viewers um, who told me that the increase I think has already happened for Chanel in USD at least for some items um, so double check um, because I think there has been an increase on seasonal items I don't know about classics but I haven't checked so just double check and have a look but there should have been an increase on seasonal um, items um, so some seasonal bags and things like that I'd love to know what you guys think about everything in this 23p preview thank you so much for watching make sure that you're fully subscribed um, you can find me everywhere linked below I'll always link where I'm available but go follow me on Instagram and go join my group thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow in my next video